Hey Stampers, Gainer again, and I've been having a play. I wanted to do a ribbon card, so you know, something totally different from Christmas, and uh, you know, I, want, I like a thank you card, but we've been doing loads of Christmassy things, but I just want to make something with ribbon. I did mine with the new ink colour ribbon, but you, it's a great way to use up retired ribbons as well. So, uh, I'll show you my card. I've also used the, oh, let me grab the box, it's just for the this little thing that came with the it starts with art I bought it ages ago and I mean ages ago when the June catalogue first came out and uh, yeah cute little box so there's another ribbon here that came with it the washes came with it these are out the blue felts uh, they're all in that bag but I kept the negatives in case we could use some of the spaces this little made with love this little paper clips there was two lots of ribbon and there was one four lots of felt so this I've got a pink one still a yellow one an orange one this really cutesy colors and the course took a banner one there so I've had a play with this I've had a not with the washes I haven't played with the washes I, they do go with this but when you see my car the little love heart that's in there can be removed to made it into a charm afterwards. But this is my little ribbon card. Look at all those beautiful ribbons. This is just tucked inside, so whoever gets the card, even without that there, it looks pretty as, as it is. But I put this on foam tape, and I just slot that in there, just to set off that cut. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous. I love craft card. I love my white gel pen. The centerpiece we cut out, I've popped inside and done a cross stitch, so you can write your little message on there still. I just think it's absolutely adorable, and I've not seen anything like it, so... This is a little strip that I've got left. I wrote my own thank you. I copied it from this set here. I mean, I could have just white heat set it, but my pen's here, so let's see if we can get my pen flowing again. How's that? I can't get any cuter than that. I will be using that again in a bit. And all I did then was snip this out into a little banner. And look at that little fringe there. So cute. Beautiful. I don't have uh, another love heart like that. These were things that were gifted to me. But I do have this gorgeous little hessian. And it's already got a hole in. So they can turn it into put that on a little pin or something so that's going to go in the next card I've got my phone strips I've got my buttons ready I have still got a love heart there maybe I'll put the stars or the flowers on it maybe yeah I think I'll have the flowers because I do love them colours there's a nice flower or two on there maybe I'll pin oh that is just the sweetest thing ever They'll get glued on there. Maybe I could maybe use the yellow one. Would it go? Yeah, why not? Oh, there's the pink one. Or even the green. Oh, look. I don't mind you, I love the love hearts. I've even got this one here. They are just the sweetest. So we'll pick one. In fact, I might even mix and match. A love heart on there with the fla little flower on there and let's see what else we've got there we've got a bit of pink the tiniest thing on there a tiny little star there as well we could mix and match you'll have a flower heart and star that way it doesn't matter which border we have oh my gosh how cute are these Anything that pops out, just pop it in my little uh, bag. But uh, yeah, just make something with a difference. You know, start wrapping things around things. So let's pop them to one side. How oh, adorable are they? I'm going to leave my card there as well because it's just the cutest. Absolutely adorable. Love it. 
so I got, like I say, I've got my buttons at the ready. I got my bone strips. I got my card base. Making sure they all tie up. And it's something different for a change. I mean, you could even use that as a Christmas card, I suppose. You could cut out a Christmas bauble instead of the shape I cut out. I've got this ready. I've got my craft card ready. I just think it looks absolutely adorable. And the craft card is three and seven eighths by five and five eighths. And I did have a piece of white card out. So I'm gonna cut the pet card down just a little bit because I don't need that much. Let's take it down to say, what's the distance on there? I did do it by three and it was just touch and go and I thought, right, oh, it's just bad. So if I make it three and a half, perfect. And it was so simple. So that's three and a half. And I did it by five. Or did I do it by five and a... Oh, let's check me hole again. <laughs> that sounds a bit rude, doesn't it? Sorry. Yes, five. I'm going to do five and a quarter just to be on the safe side. There we go. Don't need those bits. I'm going to set that to one side for a minute. I've got my half inch tape. And I'm just going to cover this. Not completely, you don't have to have it completely. You just want to make sure that you cut, especially around the edges. So, leave a half inch gap. Oh, I can't do a straight line, save me, but look at that, it's on the right lop. It's on the lop. You want it close to the edges though. Very nice. Oh, it's perfect actually. So I'm going to leave that at that. Making a right me mess here. So you smooth out all the art and you know it's going to stick then. Remove your strips. I just think it's such an adorable, cute, cute card. I've seen it done with paper, but I wanted to use up some of I think that's beautiful. Don't you reckon, girls? I'm going to leave it there for you to look at. So I've got my rib 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 ribbons. I've got them all in this little dispenser box here. I've got a glue dot on the end, so I know only to... Keep them nice and neat. You don't have to press them hard, hard on there. Gain okay, you know, eyes by the looks of it. Oh, there we go. So I'm just going to, it's quicker to take the rolls out. But like I say, you can use any ribbon you want. You could use mix and match. You could uh, just use anything. So. I start with the purple posy. And I'm getting it right on the end. Perfect. You know, and you're going to tr trim off as you go. Once you've got a little bit on there, then your, what do you call it, um, you'll have something to grip hold of. Oh, and the grandkids are on the way. I can't wait. They're only down for the weekend, but they'd have been, been and gone by the time you see this video. I'll just 
just pushing that along. Trim off. I started with the pale and worked my way, and then the darker, a little bit um, tacky at first, but you'll soon uh, you'll soon have a space in a set and now to grip onto. You don't have to be mega thingy on the ends because nobody's going to see them. So let's see which way around my corner goes. I'm going to hold that hang that just a little bit. So I think what a great impact it gives. I love it. I know it looks messy on my desk, but it's worth it. And the double-sided tape, perfect. And then just go back to the first one again. I'm loving it. Whatever way you cut off, you just spin it round. You'll have minimum waste that way. Love it. It, it will want to bend, but you can put that spray at the end. So let's get our Rococo Rose. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. And now our Cut the tile. That's that way. Well, it's like the heron bone cards with the leftover DSP. Why not do it with leftover retired ribbons instead? It just came to my head. I knew I was coming up here, I got an hour before the kids got here, and I thought, right, ribbon card. I want to make a ribbon card. And it just popped into my head. Look at that, how adorable. You can see that we're not got much waste. Back to my blue. See that spray? It's going to go this way. Look at that. Because we've cut it at a slant on the other end, turn it round, it fits on this end perfectly. Yay! Like you say, you're not going to see the ends anyway. It's not very often I get mad, mad ideas like this, but when it turns out as nice as this, then, oh my goodness, it was worth it. We're always looking for DSP or, you know, some sort of sponging and all that lot. And really speaking, we just pull out some old ribbons and away to go we are. Perfectly lined up. Absolutely. This is why you need to get it close to the edge as well. Oh my goodness, I think we've got a bit of Rococo Rose to go. And do you know what, I'm not even going to bother with that corner because it's not going to be seen. You can trim up by all means if you want to keep everything nice and tidy. Nobody's going to see it. Oh my goodness, and then you just pop these back. Got a little box with a name and a little uh, 
glue dot keeping them in in the place love it seaside spray there was not did not take long at all did it see i mean it's not hard it's not rocket science it's just being creative with what you've got love it i've used more of this raw cocoa rose than anything i love that color such a sweet color i'll be glad when the ink pad comes out and the refills perfect there's all my how long did that take 10 minutes look how pretty that looks so now you can glue this onto your card because that is going to go over the top perfect the longest thing I think took me was to do all the little uh, white gel pen stitching. And I haven't got a sewing machine. I, don't, I haven't owned one for years and years. But if you've got one, you could use them. You could stitch around it if you want, make it quicker. I didn't see any pint. That is adorable. How cute. Right, just squish that down. What I'm going to do now is grab my... There it is. <laughs> I'm going to walk about. So again, I'm just going to centralise this. And I'll be back in two shakes of a lamb's tail. even got to put it all the way I, I like this because it stands out a little bit thicker so. love it so you're going to use two pieces at best don't even have to do it all the way around if you don't want to but why not what I'm going to do now I'm just going to cut that in half into three little pieces bit of structure Perfect. Just pull the bits off now. Love it. I mean, I've seen people wrap rib the new in colour ribbons. You know, the, the organzi ones from Celebration tie a bow and then put a sentiment on but nothing like this so line this up on your card just give that a press perfect 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 I didn't do that with the foam there 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 and there on this one that's how I was able to tuck that one in but this little one I've got now is not as deep so I'm just going to pop that in there. Going to glue these on. There. 
They're just the sweetest little patterns ever. I forgot all about this set. Whoops. I'm going to even overlap them a little bit. I mean, my beautiful friend, um, Carol Woljack from the States, she hand stitches her cards. Amazing. And uh, let's pop this in the middle of the card as well. Perfect. You don't even have to pop this in if you don't want to, but I think it looks nice and sweet. Little cross stitch going on. see this in the beginning of November so we're still doing birthdays as well thank you perfect how cute pull that out just for a second and then I just did the normal stitch. I love this white gel pen. this took the longest then rather than adding the ribbon even how cute is that I love it Okay. Nearly done. You could always fast forward this bit if you want. I'm only putting a white gel pen. last stretch now. Because with the ribbon I sometimes forget to use ribbon and that and I was walking past the wardrobe the door was open because that's where my ribbon station is and uh, I thought oh a ribbon card got to have a ribbon card so I'm just tucking that in there a little button on there as well just maybe onto that lovely little top end of the love heart it will go off my buttons then are going in the top corner I've had these forever Go for. 
going to go for the blue one. I'm going to have that right there. And then I'm going to have my just glue in the bottom bit. How stinking sweet is that? So, because I use the blue predominantly, I'm going to use the blue. One, two, three. And my little ribbon. Wow, my little embellishment on the end there. Make sure it's in the middle. Perfect. I like to curl these. Wow. I tried to, didn't I? Love at that. How sweet. They can go back in my little box. I'm just going to add a blob of glue there and I'm going to stick that right there and that will go off shortly I like sometimes they'll kill if you do that if you overdo it though, they'll just go straight again. I think I need a nail for that. There we go, that's got it. See if I can get this one to do it again. Yay, that's better. How sweet is that? <gasps> I love it! Love it! Do you like it? I think they are just the cutest things ever. And I would have loved that them ribbons in every colour. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Wouldn't we all? But there you go. There is my cute, 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 cute Evan ribbon card. I love them. I like this one best. <gasps> I don't know. I like them both, but I like that one best. <laughs> my weirdo. Got a favourite? Which one do you prefer? You like me, you like this one better. I don't know, I think it's just the colours for something. Just, oh, beautiful. I am even going to grab myself a couple of little rhinestones. Got to have a bit of bling on there, girls. I'm going to put one either side of that little... Would you have thought of doing a card like this? Have you ever done a card like this? If you have, I would love to see it. Uh, that is absolutely it. I don't need to do any more to that. I think it's just the cutest. So that's just using all up retired ribbon. Well, we can use retired ribbon. I love these little boxes. That one's lost its glue dot again. <laughs> there we go. I am done. There's my ribbon. There's my embellishments. There's my two cards. I, I love it. So, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to press subscribe. Uh, and don't forget the bell. That way you'll have notifications every single day. Because I post every single day. Please don't forget to press the thumbs up and the share button. That is so always so grateful if you do that. But look how sweet they are. Oh my goodness. I've really not got some out in the ballpark, I think. Wait, I've just found a piece of card, which was too small. But thank you for watching. Come back again, and I'll see you all soon.
Take care. Bye.